Tungsten is one of the hardest metals on Earth. With a melting point over 6,000 degrees Fahrenheit, it resists corrosion and can cut through steel. Even today, working with tungsten requires modern furnaces and precision technology. Yet strange artifacts found in China suggest this knowledge may have existed centuries, perhaps millennia before it should have. In the 20th century, archaeologists uncovered bronze relics from ancient Chinese tombs, ritual vessels and weaponry that dated as far back as the Zhou Dynasty, more than 2,000 years ago. But hidden within their alloy were traces of tungsten, fused at levels far beyond what primitive smelting should have achieved. Some finds contained tungsten copper mixtures, a material we still use today in aerospace and electrical engineering. How could ancient metallurgists working with clay furnaces and charcoal have reached the temperatures needed to refine such a stubborn element? Official accounts often dismiss the samples as contamination or misidentification. But the question lingers. Were these early Chinese craftsmen experimenting with techniques we barely understand? Or could the artifacts point to lost knowledge? advanced metallurgy that vanished from history. The mystery deepens when we recall that Chinese metalwork was already centuries ahead of much of the world. They pioneered high quality bronze, cast iron and steel while Europe was still in the Bronze Age. Could tungsten have been another secret of their craft? One erased by time or perhaps deliberately hidden? To this day, the so-called tungsten anomaly remains unsolved. Was it accident, innovation far ahead of its age, or evidence that ancient civilizations knew far more about materials than history gives them credit for.